Welcome to This Week in Wise Shorts, where we talk about Wise Shorts news and cards of the day. And you know what I personally like? Reprints. Brings the price down for some certain cards and makes them all readily available for people that want them. We're getting four series that are getting reprints in Japan. SAO Ordinal Scale, Persona 5, Summer Pockets, and Fujimi Fantasia Bunko. That's not even out yet. Well, when this video comes out, it will be out, but when this was announced, it's it's not even out yet. I guess it's that popular. Kantai 5th Phase is out July 26th, and yes, Iowa oh, yeah. does have a signed card. No word about the English release, we'll probably get it in about 4 years. Fujimi Fantasia Bunko has the same writing campaign as Sneaker Bunko, where you mail in 10 coupons that come in the booster packs, and you will be entered for a raffle where you could get a personal signed card. These are cards that are hand signed by the artist or authors. Just like Sneaker Bunko, and I did mention that before. Not Weiss news, but Girls Band Pico has a special Lawson set, and it's just what it sounds like. You get two packs, plus a special foil picture board. Usually they do come with PRs, but eh, this is acceptable. If you're curious to what these look like, I actually opened a Vanguard Lawson Special Edition over in this video over here, and you know what? It's almost Christmas. I gotta start prepping for the Christmas unboxing. Last week we looked at the Okoros cards, and this week they gave us some Muse cards. So let's take a look at those super quick. Starting in green, we have Secret Letter Ellie, and she is on reverse. Rest one of your other characters, and move it to your back row, and accelerate. This card gets one level, plus 2k. Hard work in the Dirk Nico states that once per turn, when you use Accelerate, you can draw one, ditch one, and she has a pay one, resting, searching, brainstorm. Telepathy to you, Nozomi, gets 1k5 and a soul, and character discard encore. If you have three or more cards in memory and on play, draw two, ditch one, and once per turn, on attack, if you have relaxing, fun stage, you can pay two, and you mill the bottom four cards of your opponent's deck, and if you mill the Climax, you can restand this card. The Climax is a 1k1 and an arch one triggered. And we might as well talk about these now. Cheering for you, Rin, is when it's reversed. Pay one, clock, send this to memory, and you can search your deck for a character. Nine Alice Umi gives 2k forward and on play heal. And when you play relaxing fun stage and you have three or more cards in your memory, you can pay one, burn your opponent for one. What's good is that the climax works for both cards and you will be milling about five cards with both effects combined and you really want to get multiple of these Nozomis on the field to have the restand effect hit. You know, at least once. Invitation for the stage Hanayo has experienced three or more and she is a revenge. Plus 500 and a pay one rest searching brainstorm. We actually have two in this set. That's actually pretty interesting. Prop needed Kotori is a level assist, 500 forward and experience, three or more, and she gets rest this card. Give 1k to a character until the end of your opponent's turn and a climax combo. When you play heart pounding exciting stage, you stock charge and the climax is a 1k1 and a gate when triggered. Feelings that she wants to convey Honoka has experience at five or more and she gets 2k5 on play heal and when you play heart pounding exciting stage, she gets on reverse burn until the end of your opponent's turn. The last love life card we have for now is being honest once in a while Maki and she gets 2k during the turn on play heal and when you play songs for you and she is in the front row and you have four or more characters with Maki, Nico or Ellie target one of your other characters and they get the following ability on reverse, ditch a card, burn for three. The climax is a 1k1 and a buck one trigger. You know these cards are actually pretty good and I like to see what kind of decks roll out when the new set comes in. Fantasia Buko is actually out, so let's look at the last couple of cards in the set. Healing Girl Asia is a global 1k5, and Climax Cobble. She gives an extra 1k5 if first friends is in your Climax area. And she heals on play. Okay, there it is. With a name like Healing Girl Asia, I was kind of expecting it, but I kind of got a little worried there, honestly. Also, remember the 3-2 Riaz? This does not get its effect, because this is on play from hand. You get a bring an extra card from your hand which is a damn shame because if it was just like from anywhere that would be pretty good and it would work really well with the standby reward time Riaz has a pay one solo encore and when you use an act ability she gains on reverse blind stock quiet white cat koneko is on plate top check your deck leave it there and mill it and she's a level one bomb also high school dxd has a climax combo in the trial deck so that means that we might actually be able to have some pure high school dxd builds under one roof, Rumi and Sistine gets 1k if you have two or more characters, and she is an on reverse searching climax combo with Eternal Summer Eden. Kindness and Strength Rumia is a four character early drop. She is a memory heal on play and pay one ditch two, select one of your other characters, and this card gets 
plus X, where X is that character's power. What? It is only once because it's on play, you get that effect, but this could pretty much run over a lot of things. You know, assuming you have like a decently sized body on the field. This card's base is 9k, so that's already pretty high up there. So if you add like an extra 6k to it, like like let's say you have like a level one, you're you're good. You're fine. Oh wait. Oh that's it. That's the end of the episode. Well, not a lot of news or cards. Again, July 18th will be when the Bushy Road keynote is. I will be making a video on that. So expect that video in about two weeks or so. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more White Shores news and content. And I will see you guys in the next video.